All right, now we're doing free code camp. New responsive web design, learn CSS colors by building a set of colored markers. Step 15. So while we have three separate marker div elements, they look like one big rectangle, it sure does. Uh, we should add some space between them to make it uh, easier to see each element. When the shorthand margin property has two values, it sets margin top and margin bottom for the first value and margin left and margin right to the second value. So in our marker CSS rule, we're gonna set the margin property to 10 PX auto. Uh, 10 PX auto, okay. 10 PX is for the top margin and then auto for the left and right. Okay, I see. Uh, 10 PX auto. Look at that, all right, check it. Looks good and submit it. All right, now we're on to step 16 and we'll see you next time.